pull. But it's it's all a cycle because mandatory minimums yeah. came about because judges were just such pussies. Right. And letting guys go, oh, well, you know, well, well, but he wrote a poem in prison, so I'm letting him out. And I've seen this happen. I mean, in the late 70s, crime in California was out of control. It was substantially higher than it is right now. And, and you know what? This was a national problem. But then what happens when people get their laptops ripped off? Or uh, I sat in a courtroom one time, and it was a guy. This guy loves stealing Volkswagens. Do you remember the old Volkswagens? Oh, the, sure. The, the bugs? He was like a freaking pervert. He just couldn't stop stealing. And, then, and the judge literally is like, I don't know what to do with you. And I'm kind of like, you, even as a teenager, I'm like, well, I got one idea. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe put them in a cage for a little bit and see what yeah. happens. And then people get fed up and they start electing people who start talking about tough on crime. And then all of a sudden you get the three strikes.